Okay, so today is March 23rd. By the way, this is not a cold sore. I have not kissed anyone at all. Don't think I have. You're funny if you think I have a boyfriend at all. This is called eating too many salty snacks and you have a sensitive mouth. But I was just playing games with my friends and he suddenly says, Frederick, have you heard back from UNC yet? Mind you, I applied to six colleges. These are all of them. And the majority of them said I'd either hear back April 1st, but apparently they're all March 28th now. And also, Apparently UNC gives back earlier and doesn't email you, but you can check. So, my parents are downstairs right now. I'm not gonna have them next to me because if I get rejected from the school, it'll be embarrassing because this is supposed to be an easier school to get into. But I have my school laptop here with me and I'm gonna see if we got in or not. Ooh, status update. All right, let's go. And I did not get in. Yeet. One, I'm not gonna cry because I don't really care about the school that much. So kind of bummed that the first college I look at <laughs> didn't get into. Hopefully I get into my dream college which is NYU and it's not too much financial aid. We'll wait five days more until I get every college back all in one go at the same time. All right, so we're in the parking lot right now and all right, Fred, what are you about to do? Uh, my friend just told me NYU admissions are out. And uh, she got waitlisted, and I don't know if I'm getting it! All right. Are you ready? Yeah. You gonna be your best? <gasps> oh my god! Yes! <gasps> Does that mean you got in? Yes! yes! <laughs> oh my gosh, Fred! <laughs> I got in! You have been admissioned! <laughs> NYU was founded in 1831. <laughs> oh! Fred! And you got cute clothes! How do you feel? It feels like I came out again. When I first came out, I felt like so much pressure went off my chest, and this is the same feeling. Oh my god. I didn't cry. I didn't cry. <laughs> Still have yet to cry on camera for you guys. <laughs> oh, I'm ready to get rejected from UPenn and Columbia. Anyone you'd like to? Okay. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Time for me to get rejected. Oh my god. Wait, we gotta record your rejection. It's okay. I have my. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. We have my camera too. Huh? I don't even care. Three, two, one. Okay. <laughs> Go. Yeah, rejection. <laughs> okay, Frederick. I don't care. All right, let's keep going. You can. Yeah, I mean, I got into. In my use, so that's in all I need. You? Okay, here we oh, go. Columbia. Columbia. This is it. A rejection! Oh my god. <laughs> that's how stupid it has. Oh my god. Like, I'm going. I got accepted into one college, so I have to go to that one college. <laughs> hey guys, so that's about all of the decisions for now. Temple has yet to give me one. I don't know why. It's fun though. If you couldn't catch what happened um, or if you skipped to the video. I got into one college, my dream college, NYU. So yeah, congrats for me. But I checked my financial aid package and let's just say there was a lack of one because I received zero dollars, which means I'll be paying $72,506 for the first year. And that will increase to around 80000 for the fourth year. And I know most of these videos are like, Ah, I got in. Oh my god, I'm so excited. I mean, this is the honest truth. Like, I submitted my CSS profile late. And for those of you who don't understand what I'm talking about, in the United States, there are several ways you can get money for your college. So FAFSA is one that the federal government can give you. CSS is one that College Board gives you. College Board manages the school education system. Most colleges don't require the CSS. It's mainly the upper ones, so like IVs and all of that. If you don't know what IVs are, just look it up. But NYU says that they require the CSS and the FAFSA to be submitted at a certain due date. I submitted the FAFSA on time. I didn't know CSS was existed at the time, so I submitted that late by two weeks, and I guess that just meant I'm not eligible for any institutional or in-state scholarships just because I couldn't submit it on time, and I'm like kicked off the roster for any scholarships. Uh, I'm gonna call them tomorrow, and I scheduled an appointment with my guidance counselor to see if there's any way to get any aid 
so it can be a little bit less than 72,000. I mean, the truth is like, I just think it's all my fault because I couldn't submit something on time because I'm dumb and I didn't think or read enough. Like it was supposed to be a really happy day for me. And now it's just really sad because like everyone's congratulating me about getting into NYU and they're all like, you deserve this. You, I mean, you fit in, like, you're everything that NYU wants, and you just are a city boy, and I'm like, that's all true, but how am I even going to afford that? And, I, yeah, I am very happy for getting into NYU, obviously, like, I know that it's so, so hard to get into it, and a lot of people would die for the opportunity just to even get accepted, but what does it matter getting accepted if I can't even go? But... I have to go to sleep, so, yeah.